Welcome back to Dandelion. Um, we're just trucking along after our abusive little... Um, there's an art gallery now. I don't think that was there before. After our abusive little episode with Jisoo. We don't, we don't really like him, but we're we're here for the ride. So, <laughs> an art exhibition. Okay, let's go. This building is so big, it impresses me every time we come here. Let's hurry in. <laughs> Look at this. Isn't this hilarious? It's not polite to laugh at artwork. Yeah, it, it a bit funny, but you're not supposed to laugh out loud here. I see. Okay, this place requires those manner thingies. I'm a good cat, so don't worry. I'm not going to embarrass you. Uh, let's get inspired. So, did you get an inspiration from these works? What are you going to draw this time? I don't know much about the art, but your pictures always bring, make me feel good. So, I'm looking forward to your next piece. Heart gauge, learn the increase. Art skills, slightly increased. Nice. I feel like I've learned something today. Cool. <laughs> Man, using my brain makes me hungry. You're going to cook for me at home, right, food giver? Today, the day is over. I should rest. Okay. <clears throat> It's November 5th. Uh, we are still in the process of getting our hearts with Catboy. Oh, immediately into another scene. Let's go. Oh, we're with HeJ. Study art. Watch documentary. Let's get the documentary because he's in the living room a lot, but we're not meeting him. <clears throat> Is it going to the crab school a drag? I shrugged at Hijay's comment. I don't know. I guess. It's been over a year since I attended this crab school because it's supposedly famous. My scores aren't improving. I looked to Hijay, who was sighing. Since when did I attend English cram school? <laughs> what? <laughs> since when have I been here? <clears throat> I know that it was since middle school. Mom signed me up for a class saying that <clears throat> what I'm learning in school isn't enough. There were many students of my age in the cram school. Since then, going to an English cram school became a part of my life. In the days that I didn't go, I would only I would become oddly anxious, and it felt like I was beginning to lag behind others. And because it was not something I voluntarily wanted to do, it never felt that fun. Listening to the lectures in the English cram school would free me from my anxiousness a bit. I felt that I'm okay because I'm doing what everyone else is doing. And it feels good when I'm sometimes get a decent TOEIC score. Hey, you right there. Oh. Familiar voice brought me back to reality. A tall guy was standing in front of me. Black hair, defined nose and mouth, and black beanie. Jisoo, do you know him? I knew it. You said you don't have a boyfriend. Wait, why is Jisoo here? Jisoo and Hijay stared at each other without a word. Jisoo was scowling at Hijay with a fierce look. Hijay, who looked frightened, poked my arm with his finger. He jug. Uh, who is he? Jisoo, how did you even know this place? I followed you. The levels that this man is not okay is insane. He's basically telling me that he was stalking me. I'm getting a headache. I was bored at home. I was walking around outside and saw you go in this building, so I waited until you came out. Then he suddenly waited for me for nearly two hours. Two hours just standing here, glaring at people who were passing by. He's a pretty good looking guy, but no girl would ever approach him since he's scowling at everyone who walks by. He, he Jung. He J called me in a feeble voice. Uh, yeah, this is he J. He is a friend from school who goes to the same cram school as I do. Yeah, yeah, I'm sure he is. Jisoo replied in a sarcastic voice, crossed his arms and glowered at he J. Even more intensity. EJ gulped and hid behind me. He doesn't have to be that scared. Jisoo, why are you glaring at my friend like that? It's rude. I could hear a faint growl. Don't tell me the whole world. Don't tell the whole world you're a cat. Well, who the hell is he? How come I can always smell him from your clothes? What? What are you talking about? I, I didn't yet do. What? What did you say, buddy? Yet? <laughs> Jisoo, it's all a misunderstanding. Misunderstanding? You two were together in that building for more than two hours, and you're telling me that it's a misunderstanding? I let out a big sigh. Oh, this guy. I was getting a little angry at Jisoo for coming here all of a sudden and scaring EJ, who's done nothing wrong. This is where we study, stupid cat. Cat? 
He changed words, made me realize that I made a mistake. Oh no, should have said the word cat. And to make the matters worse, Jisoo was snarling. What? Hey. Jisoo suddenly grabbed my wrist and pulled me toward him. Hey. <laughs> I lost my balance and almost fell into Jisoo's arms. Let's go home. Come on. Jisoo's hand was burning and was covered in sweat. Why is his hand so hot? I awkwardly waved at EJ while being dragged away by Jisoo. Sorry, EJ. See ya. See ya. <laughs> <sighs> Jisoo's the worst, but he J is he J. I felt bad towards EJ, but resisting Jisoo's hand would make the matter worse. Jisoo, let me let me go now, okay? No, you're not going back. You're gonna go back to him. I'm not. He's just a friend. Oh, so he's just a friend. You two looked awfully chummy coming from the building together. What are you talking about? That's not it. Don't lie. I know for a fact that you have his scent on you at least once or twice a week. You won't listen to me. You won't explain why he's overreacting and why he's so angry. Why does Jisoo always interfere in all my affairs? Why is he dragging me away right now? Why am I not resisting him? That's a good question. And why do I try so hard to let Jisoo know that it's all just a misunderstanding when I really don't need to? Also a good question. It seems like we're... I stopped walking. Why are you like this to me? What? You wait for me, you're jealous of EJ, you drag me away from him, I don't know the reason why you're acting like this. Oops, I clicked auto. Hmm, <clears throat> you won't explain anything to me. I also don't understand why he thought I was crying over a guy when I had a nightmare. Why? Why do I let Jisoo behave like this? Reason. Yes, the reason. Do I really have to tell you in words? Bro. <laughs> <clears throat> I became so confused by Jisoo's reply. Hmm. Does he have to? That's... Of course, I'm confused if you don't tell me anything. I really don't know. I sometimes think, does he? And then often get embarrassed because he might have deluded myself into thinking that something that's not even a bit true. It's all because this cat won't explain anything to me. I'm confused about why he won't say anything yet acts this way. Can't you just see? I wouldn't unless you tell me. Well, that's pretty obvious, but okay. Told him the honest truth. I really don't know if you won't tell me anything. I really have no idea. Especially when it comes to reading guys' minds. Huh. You're cute. W what? My face suddenly became very hot. Food giver, you still don't know. I. Uh, cute? Me? My heart began to pound. That's how they get in your head, ladies. The abusers. <laughs> they abuse the shit out of you, and then they're just like. You're really cute, and you're like, I'm cute. <laughs> no, <laughs> I don't know. Why is he being so subtle? Are you trying to tease me, or I like you? I thought my heart stopped for a while when I heard what Jisoo said. Did Jisoo say that he? Did I hear him wrong? Did he really just say that he likes me? I said I like you. Jisoo said the same sentence again, as if he's trying to cast away all doubts. He really does like me. Jisoo likes me. I like you, so don't meet up with other guys because I like you. Okay, well, that's still a little fucked up. Our eyes met. Uh, <laughs> I was too embarrassed to speak. I've never had anyone confess his feelings so straightforwardly before. And what about you? Me? I couldn't think of a way to respond right away. This is embarrassing. I realized the first time how hard it was to convey my feelings. What should I say? I should say something. You don't have to answer. Huh? If you don't like me, I'll make you like me. Also, bad thing to say. Jisoo grabbed my hand and started walking again. What? What? Why is he making? Why is he making conclusions to everything? And how come he's so confident? Make me like him? I should tell him. I have to tell him. That's why I let him push me around, and why I let him do things that I normally wouldn't allow anyone else to do. That I don't mind him acting as he pleases because I. Me too. Open my mouth, and Jisoo stopped. What? Jisoo looked at me in surprise. Me too. It's embarrassing, but I have to tell him. I like you too. Jisoo's eyes widened. I... I said it. I told him that I liked him. Jisoo looked bemused for a moment. Ah. Jisoo smiled warmly at me. This is the first time I'm confessing to a guy. Jisoo began to walk without a word, holding my hand. 
Did he hear my confession? My face was so red that I didn't have the courage to look at Jisoo, who was walking in silence. I could feel the warmth of his hand, which seemed to heat up my entire body. Okay, but why is his hand so warm? Do we know? It's still a bit strange, isn't it? Hmm. 